NATO's clear position has been to condemn Russia's military actions in Ukraine and to make clear that President Putin's decisions to escalate the situation have consequences. What we will do, always, is uphold our solemn obligation, our Article 5 duty to defend the sovereignty and territorial integrity of our allies. And in that promise, we will never waver. NATO nations never stand alone. This is a great day for NATO. This is a great day for the United States of America. And this is a great day for Poland. Today, we welcome to Latvia our allies, troops of the 173rd Infantry Brigade Combat Team of the U.S. Army Europe. I believe that exercising and training together is what makes us allies. Trust is what makes us strong. The transatlantic link is not something that Estonians take for granted. Rather, we see it as a vital element of security in an unsecure world. Operation Atlantic Resolve will continue to demonstrate the United States' solemn commitment to the collective defense of all NATO allies. Atlantic Resolve, I think, is the new normal exercise profile of U.S. Army Europe. And all of these exercises are with our allies. They'll all be multinational, they'll all be joint distributed exercises. So that assures allies and it improves our interoperability for the alliance. What we've described the environment of the future is, it's going to be a very complex environment, it's going to be a multinational environment, it changes very quickly. You have to have what we call multiple options in multiple domains with multiple partners. So when you take a look at what Atlantic Resolve does, is training folks to operate that way and then applying it right here in the middle of a very complex part of the world. The United States Army has developed this concept called Regionally Aligned Forces. So there is going to be a big part of the Army that is focused on Europe, being able to rotate units to come over to train but also having a depth of understanding of the culture, the history, the geography, the infrastructure. This is going to be a permanent part of how the Army operates. So it's the Army's regionally aligned force concept is what enables it to contribute indefinitely to Atlantic Resolve.